Yo, what's up, and Xavier? Today I am here at V Mampa Street to visit this two interesting food place here. If you guys remember Sage Square Pizza, right? So now they are the Quadrato Pizza. So I'm going to try out again their pizza. And also, there is this trending palabok and bok choy overload here, and their name is called the palabok sa animal. No, that's wrong. Animal. Right now, I'm already here at Quadrato Pizza. I'll see you guys again after I order one. Right, so we just done ordering our food. So we ordered a pizza here at Quadrato Pizza and a palabok and a bat choy overload at the Palabox Animal. Yo bro, the owner here at Cardato Pizza is so accommodating. We were supposed to dine there at Palabox Animal. Yeah, we, we talked to the owner of Cardato Pizza. They accommodate us with tables so we can dine here. That is just amazing. Right now, we're just waiting for a pizza. And before we get this food trip started, if you guys are new to my channel or haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do. You're doing me a big favor by doing so. And also hit that notification bell so that you will be always notified from all of my channel's activities. Our food is here and I'm just so hungry right now. Again, I have here some bad choy and some palabok. I got this from the palabok's animal. It's just across the street. Let's have a taste of this bad choy overload first. Let's try the broth. This one is so ridiculously rich with beefy flavor and I so like that. This is the ban choy overload. Yeah, you can see on top there's chicharron, boiled egg, some scallions, and um, liver, and chunks of beef. And let's try to check the noodles. Medium-sized noodles. Um, as I said earlier, the broth, man. This broth is so rich with beefy flavor. Mmm. Mmm. There's a lot of beautiful textures from that bite. Crunchiness from the chicharron, chewiness from the liver, and then that soft and delicate beef meat is so amazing. This bacha is so addictive. Once you start eating this one, there's no stopping unless it's all gone. So this is the closer look of their palapok. So there's two calamansi there. Huge pieces of chicharron, egg, scallions, and that reddish palapok sauce. So if we try to check on to the noodles. Yeah. There's the glass noodles there. I cannot wait to have a try on this one. Now let's finally have a taste of the palabok. Mmm, it's savory, salty, and peppery, and I so love the shrimpy flavor of the sauce. Mm. 
And this one really brings back memories for me. Since we also ordered additional lumpia, let's invite the lumpia to the party. Out of this world, yummy. So for the star of the show, to be honest, I haven't tried a pizza that has durian flavor. So for me, this is really, really interesting. But first, um, let's try... Let's try the rosemary chicken first. Mm. You can definitely smell and taste the rosemary on this one. Super thin crust pizza. Let's take a closer look of this rosemary chicken pizza. Yes, yeah, so look at that. Chicken meat that creamy and savory white sauce and it's super thin crust now it's time to add some sauce to the pizza let's try this mm, that definitely levels up the flavor of this pizza Mm. This rosemary chicken is awesome. Yeah, and the light. Mmm. Oh boy. Dude, this durian delight is so good. If you are a durian lover, this is definitely the pizza for you. Wow. Creamy, sweet, savory, and durian-y flavor. You know what's awesome? The durian flavor is not overpowering this entire pizza. It really blends so well with the other flavors. Saying it's delicious will be a complete understatement. This one is so incomparable. This will absolutely be added to your favorite piece of flavor list. Now let's add some flavor to this combo.
Yo, the owner here at Card Tartu Pizza is so accommodating, guys. Like I said earlier, she gave us a bonus. Uh, we have here a lecha plan and their barbecue chicken. So they also offer barbecue chicken here and some other barbecue meats as well. So today, we're going to try their barbecue chicken. This really smells so good. Just from the looks of it, it's so juicy. So let's try this one. First bite of the barbecue chicken. Mmm. The sauce is sweet, savory, and salty. The chicken meat is so ridiculously tender. And this one has this beautiful scent. So let me show you how juicy this chicken meat is. Look at that. It's glistening with its juice. And if you can see this one, that's how tender this chicken meat is. Look at all the juice traps inside the chicken meat. Another bite of the chicken. Mmm. Mmm. Every time you chew further from the chicken, it's gonna release more of that chickeny juice that is just so sensational inside of your tongue. Another one. Mm. What I really love about this one is that the marinade was able to penetrate the deepest part of the chicken. So every time you chew, you will still get that sweetness from the marinade. And it's so awesome. Another bite. Mm. You should definitely try their barbecue chicken. So flavorful. She also gave us some lecha flan here, so let's try this. Mm. Mm. So flavorful. Texture wise, you can definitely tell that it's prepared so well. Mm. Texture is on point. The sweetness level is perfect. This is so wonderful. Mm. And I am just so full right now, guys. The owner was very friendly. She's so accommodating. We had a chat with the owner and she's so friendly. She's been feeding us with a lot of food. When it comes to their food, absolutely so flavorful, delicious. The pizza, man. Whenever you try their pizza here at Cardato Pizza, you should definitely try the durian delight or the Davao durian flavor because it was really, really good. You can definitely tell that the durian flavor is pure and it's so satisfying to eat because they have this perfect texture, thin crust pizza. The overall flavor is just so awesome. Also from their barbecue chicken, they just started selling their barbecue chicken as for lunch. It's available for dinner. I would say you should try it as well because it's so rich with flavor, marinated so well and the chicken meat is so amazingly tender. I would really recommend you guys coming here. They're located here v mapa street just in front of the ceramic pro so if you have any suggestions for my next food location just drop it down in the comments below i would definitely read all of it and make sure to visit all those places so i hope you enjoyed this video again this is me as dave and i'll see you in the next one creamy sweet durian if you